Hey there, let's see how the uh, OBJ import works in Plexus 3. Uh, here I have a bit of project here. Let me create a new composition, a new solid, and apply Plexus. And it it works pretty much like version 2, but with a slight uh, difference. Uh, so to show that, let me create a new uh, OBJ object here. Now, previously there used to be a little button here that says import OBJ, but it's no longer present because now it works through a layer. So to, to import an OBJ file, you have to go to file, import file, and go select an OBJ file you want. Uh, for example, let me select uh, an OBJ file. And it's now imported as a footage here. And you could drop that in the composition and go to your OBJ object and select that layer. Now, many times OBJs have different settings. Here it's a small little blip here. So you need to adjust the scaling and everything. So crank up the scale really high. And you can see this. You can invert the thing you want. So this is how the new uh, OBJ import works. Uh, the same way you can import OBJ sequences too. Uh, for example, I have an OBJ sequence and you can just open it as, uh, make sure this is selected as an After Effects file sequence. And you can input that too. You can turn off the layer if you want and uh, select the uh, sequence. Now this is a little high here, let me go back to 100. Now, I don't know if you see it, let me create the dots, okay. So you can import an OBJ sequence that way too.